Now your certified storm ready forecast from NBC 25. Welcome back. Well, the snow just didn't quite go away completely today as I thought it would last night at this time, but fortunately we didn't see a whole lot in the way of accumulation. Here's a live look at what we have in downtown Frankenmuth right now. It doesn't look like much snow out there. People uh, getting around just okay tonight. We are expecting by this time tomorrow night though that more snow will start to move in the area and by Sunday morning it could stick. We are looking at still cold temperatures this weekend. Keep in mind our average high at this time of year is right around 47 to 48 degrees. That snow tomorrow night into Sunday morning. 20s for highs in your extended forecast. I'll show you when we're expecting that in just a few moments. Overall, the trend has been, uh, been for these snow showers to taper off. And you can see further to the west, some clearing taking place in Wisconsin and sections of the western UP. And the snow that is out there is heavier on the western side of the state. We're mainly just looking at flurries. Here in mid Michigan, Futurecast actually doesn't pick up on any snow at 8 p.m. I think we'll still see some, especially over the thumb and in our northern counties at 8 o'clock tomorrow morning and right on through the afternoon tomorrow. You can see that we're just partly to mostly cloudy, so we do get a break from the snow showers tomorrow, but a cold front coming through tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow night, more like tomorrow night into Sunday morning, will bring another round of snow that could accumulate across the air. You can still see the snow going on through the morning hours on Sunday. It starts to break up on Sunday afternoon and then some lake effect may try to redevelop later Sunday afternoon into Sunday night. As far as snowfall accumulations with that event tomorrow night into Sunday morning, we are looking at generally around one to two inches in most areas, so be ready for that. But the hunters tomorrow morning shouldn't have to worry about it. Look for temperatures around 20 with light southwesterly winds, so uh, cold readings is all you'll have to deal with if you're planning on hunting tomorrow morning. For tonight, looking at a low of 20 degrees, uh, flurries will tend to taper off from south to north, and then for tomorrow, a high of 34 with partly to mostly cloudy skies. And our average high this time of year is still 48 degrees, so well below that, and we really don't get anywhere near that in your seven day forecast, perhaps a little bit closer on Friday of next week. But in the meantime, temperatures will dip into the 20s for highs on Tuesday and look at those low temperatures, 19 degrees on Monday and Tuesday night. Uh, after this weekend snow event, we could still be talking about some snowfall accumulations early next week, especially on Tuesday as that very cold air crosses Lake Michigan. Bill.